No, and welcome to this new video of Franbo. Let's go to the mechanical doll and uh, see what the fuck I'm supposed to do with that thing. Hey, the one's there. Use the levers on the nearby tree to gradually pass the one until it reaches the spot where you can grab it. Okay. Very useful guide when it literally doesn't tell you the fuck how to do it. Gradually faster one. Uh, I got it. There you go. Now you put that hand up. You put that hand down. You put that hand up. You put that hand down again. That doesn't work. So you put that hand down. You put that hand up. You put that hand up. You don't get it. You get it, and that works. I don't know how that worked, but okay. I can go home. Woo! No vision, really? Okay. What is up, pussy? I got your one. Let's go. This you one, sir, wizard. How magnificent blood did you do it? Really? Uh, what are the stones? Can I borrow them? I can't lend you the stones. The stones are very, very special. Uh, what I can do is place the stones on the locks of the floor of the door. But you, you are the only one who can turn the key and actually open the door. Oh, I see. The king told me you would show me where the door is. And then we should go and talk with him. Uh, don't you think? Mm, wait, I suspect that you can't turn home looking like a tree. Do you think? I almost forgot. Yes, you're right. Can you bring my human body back? Yes, I can. This is exciting. I haven't done this in hundreds of years. Uh, let's make a human. Yes. Give me your clothing. I need to smell it. Are we sure this is not the pedophile from the fucking asylum? Here, sir, my clothing. Mmm, let me smell this. <laughs> this can work. <laughs> we will make a human. Okay, now that sounds weird, actually. Let me smell your clothes, little kid. Okay, now let's make a human. It's a dude, she's a girl. This game is weird. Good, now go to the center of the star. <laughs> Think about your body, your head, your leg, and the other leg. Can I, like, think that I have big boobs or, like, a dick? If I think about that, will you give that to me? And your arm, both of them, now concentrate. What if I forget that I have, a, that I have an asshole? Like, will you forget that? Randomly selected elements, find your path with your true essence. Become friend, the human, now! That worked out great! Huh. Are you alright? Uh, what happened? Is it done? Oh, you look done. Oh, thank you so much, sir. You're really a great wizard. Yes, that's my name, Great Wizard. Because of the greatness. Hmm. I think we have to go to the king now, so he can show me the door. Yes, I'll be right there. I have to finish something. I'll be there. Go now. Okay. I'm staying in winter time just in case. What up? You're not the king. Everything is fine. I guess. Feels like heaven. West Virginia. What are you? Leave Mr. Midnight alone. 
Is your head playing with you again? Can't you see yourself in the mirror? There's no mirror here. I'm not you. I'm not. Mr. Midnight Go now. Kill the traitors because that's where he is, friend. Don't you see? My kitty is not a traitor. He promised me to be my my side. He promised. As your mommy and daddy did. Who promised to take good care of you? Well, I mean, it's hard to take care of someone when you're dismantled. You know? Dismembered and shit. Like, uh, it's kind of hard. Wake up, friend. You are surrounded by traitors. Leave me alone. Leave my friend alone. I'm the only one you have, friend. I'm the one who's always by your side. Let's get rid of this traitor, huh? Are you Canadian? What do you say? Let's be happy. I'd be so very happy together. Did. Go away! It wasn't me. Hey, what up, King? Man, what's wrong? Why are you crying? I'm crazy, sir. I'm totally crazy. The doctors were right. But you're not crazy. I'm very sorry that you feel that way. You should be happy now. You found the stones and you became human again. That is very great indeed. Don't wipe my tears. Your cat can hurt me. I want to hurt you, my dear, and I feel like I'm about to do it at any moment. You won't. I know that because you love me. Yes, kitty, I do love you very much. Oh, Adorable. Friend, remember what I told you. You love your life. And that is the only thing that matters. You will always find the power to fight those monsters in you. Now let's go open the gate and you can go home. Yes, let's do this. Whenever, like... The game comes up with a calm soundtrack. It's very nice. I swear to God, if you tell me that the door is literally me jumping down, that means the fucking vision I had like a long time ago was fucking right and I should have just done that. Yes, but where's the door? All right, I have to make it visible. But are you sure you want to go back? Yes. All right, here we go. The woman must leave. Open the secret door into her reality. Let the human return home. Neat. Oh, whoa! We're going home, kitty! Oh, Zyre the King! Good day to you. I bought the stone so this lovely creature can go home. Thank you, sir. I'm very nervous. It will be strange to be far away from you all. Then don't leave. I can make you a place to stay. A very magical place. It was a chest to leave. I received a message from the one from one of the Velokas, and she's not ready. Oh, I see. What are you talking about? Ready for what? Come on, wizard. Place the stones. We have no time to lose. But ready for what? You know what the Velokas told you about facing the truth? Uh, yeah, something I can remember. Well, should I? Yes, go ahead, wizard, sir. Magic stones! Great to lock that only the human can break. What's the point of having a door that only humans can open? If you literally never have humans here. Well, now it's time for friend to be the key. You're the only one who can open this now. Oh, alright, let's see. Uh, what's the thing? Oh, well, it's super easy. Um, okay. Ta-da! Now this one goes... Oh, fuck you. Okay. Okay. Okay, so that is first. No. No. I didn't even need the guide actually for that part. <laughs> nice smell of victory again! You smell a lot of things, even little ghost clothing, which is kind of weird. Can you, like, um, actually, I'm glad I'm gone. Bye! Can go home now. I'm so excited! I just can't hide it.
I wish I could leave you something so you can remember me. No! We won't forget you. You're a very special creature. Yeah, the only one that got turned into a fucking tree that got turned back into a human. I almost forgot. Palantras gave me this for you. The fuck is this shit? Oh, thank you. Tell Palantras that I wish I could help him with his wounds. I give my aid patch. My aid patch is to a girl in the hospital, but anyway. I'll tell him. And don't worry, Palantras is better now. Oh, and before you go, you must know. Before you return to your reality, you will go through the secret woods. The woods are kind of in of invisible passage between our realities. And uh, you may encounter terrible creatures that want to eat you. But just run. You're quite slow. And you're telling me this now? That sounds very scary. Don't worry, you'll do fine. I hope so. Oh, uh, Mr. Midnight, say goodnight. Let's go now. Bye, gentlemen. I had a great time. I like you very much. Goodbye. Oh shit. Well that would... Okay. Can I like press space too? No, it's just click. Cat has a bigger range than me. Does that fucking troll have a penis? It has a penis. Interesting. Oh my fucking god. You know, running away from the monster is easy. Um. Not falling inside the fucking holes is hard. I wonder what happens if I just get caught? Interesting. Okay, can I skip? There you go. Skipped. So this fucking skip feature was only just made for this. Because <laughs> the platforming in that part fucking sucks. Part one, my imaginary friend. Because it's so fucking pixel perfect. Which usually you don't do. My goodness, the door opened now. Wow, interesting. Hello, Mr. Midnight. I ain't found out where we are. I found my pills. Why is my hand, like, cut? Is that new? Oh, we can find home soon. I'm sorry. It's midnight, look, I think we are on the other side of the bridge. Remember the one we tried to cross before we fell into I Thursday? Yes, I remember. Hey, let's keep going, kitty. You have to be careful now. Come back, pills! Hey! Ohm! I guess Ohm is in that direction. Oh no! Oh no! I shouldn't have touched the pills! Bad friend! Bad! Bad! It's okay, I got a knife. Woohoo! Hey, Itrem! How you doing? Fan, you're already here! Well, I was inspecting you until 235. And, as I see, you're not trapped anymore. Interesting. Anyway, let me introduce myself. I am Itward, your faithful friend. Itward? 
Do I know you from somewhere? You seem familiar. Yes, I'm the creator of the night. We've been playing together. I helped you to get Mr. Midnight back, you see? Really? Huh? I think I managed quite well to find my kitty on my own. Hey, aren't you the one that made the sisters mad? No, it wasn't me making the sisters mad. They believed it wasn't me. You see? But it's because they never looked into themselves. What do you mean they never looked into themselves? They blame me instead of facing the fact that their parents never loved them. Okay. But let's stop talking about the sisters, shall we? Don't you recognize me, dear friend? The long man with the top hat? I always came by night and told you stories when you were just a little baby. I came to find you. I came to you after you imagined me. You're my ma you're my blah, 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 blah. You're my imaginary friend. Oh, but I'm not imaginary, you see? I'm part of your reality. Did I imagine you? You're quite familiar, yes, I can't deny that. I exist because you exist. The truth is that you are able to imagine me because I already existed. Come again? Anyway, we don't have time to talk about this right now. Actually, I'm here to take you home. Follow me. Okay. Take me home? I can let you do that. I don't know you. I would hurt you. I'm not made out of darkness. I'm your friend. Hmm. Alright. You seem nice. I'll go with you. But I won't trust you yet. That's fine. But come on now. I have something to show you. He is very tall. He seems nice. Probably a skeleton face. His house went beep beep boop. That can't be a bad guy. Behold! The it would flying machine! What do you think? I love it! There's many buttons to push. Yes! With its gorgeous piece of machinery, I'll take you home. Was I as soon as I fix the details? Besides, it's not 235 yet. That sounds great, but uh, what is it? About 235, sir. I don't understand. It's when time becomes slower, and that gives us a chance to enter the ultra reality. Inside the ultra reality, we can travel wherever we want to go. Right now, we are standing on the endless limits of the second reality. But you're part of the third reality. You understand? Yes, I do understand. It sounds insane. But sir, should I just wait until you're done fixing the machine? Wait? Of course not! You can help by getting the water and fire berries, alright? Alright. It's better to do something than nothing at all, I guess. Great! There's my amazing handmade bucket for the water. I made it myself. Yeah, usually that's what handmade means. And the fire berries, you'll realize your berries pick up because of the fire. Alright, but sir, can I just ask, what do you need the berries and the water? Ah, well, the berries are incredibly good fuel. They last many, many hours. And the water is to get rid of the dirt. The kamalas. Oh, kamalas, I see. I hope they don't come around the flying machine. We never know. But we do know that they don't like water, yes? Oh darling, I almost forgot. Your medicine, you need. Some things are so vis invisible to your eyes, you see? Here. Invisible to my eyes? Hmm. I see, well thank you. I was trying to catch the pills earlier, but the trap caught me first. Oh yes, about that, I'm sorry, I need to get your attention somehow. Okay, so I defeated the trap, like in one second. Anyway, I'll go get the fireberries and the water. I'll be right back. Great! I'll be preparing the machine. What's that thing? I don't think that's how you are supposed to fix it. Anyway, there's something here.
Mm. Okay, now I'm supposed to go right twice. Fireberries! What up, pussy? Get out, get out. You're trespassing on my territory. I thought you were dead. How can you possibly think that? You have no manners, young lady. I'm sorry. Me, rotten and bloody? I think I misunderstand this situation. What? It's a moose? I'm not a moose. I'm a deadly worm. Is that a deadly worm? No, no, not a deadly worm. A deadly worm. I don't go around killing creatures. I just give back to soil what creatures took from it and don't need anymore. I only see a talking moose. Where are you? Um, that's a penis. Down there, creature. Can't you see me? My name is Fan. Oh, Fan, can I ask why did you touch the moose in the first place? No, only, only scavengers would touch dead animals. Are you one? Of course not. I was trying to see if I could climb on it to reach the fireberries. I see. I think it is possible. The moose is still very sturdy and solid. But the fireberries are on fire. You can hurt yourself. Yes, I see the fire, but you have to take them somehow. Good luck with that. Come on now. I keep working. Thank you. Just cut that. Okay, go down. Oh, this is the way to hell. Well, then cut them, then. And boom, I did it. How do I go down now? I guess that's how. Hey, that's my body. Can you guys stop doing that? That's kind of weird. Ew, I look completely deformed. I don't know if this friend is really me. But from some other place. Am I nutritious? I bet I am. Tasty fresh. Flesh. Mmm. Mmm. Where did I get the water? So I brought the fire berries, but they are not on fire anymore. Magnificent, it was just fine. Thank you very much, my darling. You're welcome. Did I get the water? Did you find the fire berries and water already? We need them for the journey back home. Well, I didn't find the fire berries. Uh, I mean, I, I found, found the fire berries, but I need the water. Where the fuck do I find the water? There's no water. Is there water? Because the guide isn't really telling me about water. Hell? I don't want to go there. Okay. What does it say? Give it fire berries and water. Where the fuck do you get the water? Oh. Would you allow me to tie this bucket to your beautiful hair? Tie a bucket to your hair? Why? That sounds insane! It's not insane at all. I need water from under the cliff, but I can't reach it. I need to use your beautiful long hair as a rope. Please help me. Alright, we'll help you. Tie the bucket real tight. Oh, thank you. You're very nice. Thanks. The bucket is now full of water. Home is somewhere we all wish to belong, but does it 
does home belong somewhere? I don't get it. It was a rhetorical question. I just wanted to say that. You're on your own. Home. Welcome yourself inside. You will find many doors to open. Hmm. Sounds kind of gay. Hey, Edward, I got a bucket. Hey, Edward, there's a bucket full of water. You mean the Luciferns? Oh, nice, yes, but only when you see them in this reality. They're very dangerous if you ever see them in the fifth reality. They can burn you. Oh, burn me? Well, I haven't been into the fifth reality yet. I don't recommend it. What's reasonable there may be the worst you'll ever experience. Oh, I forgot to thank you for the water. Thank you, friend. Oh, friend, it's 2.34. The journey will begin. Let's go inside the machine. Now kill us. Who was inside? I shake and scoop. This is spooky. <laughs> A little bit. It's 2.36. We have a great possibility of reaching your target in good condition. We'll soon be on our way to the third reality. Are you excited, friend? Maybe I would be excited if I could understand more. You soon understand. The answers are not easy to recognize. How strange, but okay. Time goes as it has to. In order for you to be alive. If it all happened now, you'd probably explode. Huh. Not exactly. You know what? I'd rather say through time you have to explore and experience to understand. This means the answers will come when you find them. Not when others tell you how or where to find them. Hmm. That's a bad thing you can do for yourself. Be curious and you'll always be amazed. But now, friend, we have to get things done. Talking won't take you home. The machine needs some maintenance, and I think you would do incredible work. Here are the fire berries and the water you gathered before. Thanks. Why did I give them to you if you were just gonna give them back to me? You need them to get the water pump working again and the fuel mixed. You find all the information you need when you enter the room to the left. But feel free to enter any room you wish. I'll be quite busy fixing the automatic driver. But if you have something to ask, I'll be here. Okay, see ya. Well, um, I've heard there's a computer. Mala Hunt. Woo. This is literally just space invaders. Except some of them are shaped like dicks. So it's a better space invader, honestly. How much do you require to die? Woo! I'm a pro. Controls are very shit. I'm not shooting, by the way. I'm just moving the ship. Oh, almost died. Winner! Attack of the Easter Egg. I 
motherfucker. Motherfucker, can you die? Oh my god, die! <laughs> Unpredicted behavior from Itwork computer machine database has been found. Itwork has been shut down. I guess they're allowed. Stop. Okay. Got the Easter egg. But anyway, I'm gonna stop there for this video. So, thank you all so much for watching this video of Fred Bo. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you all next time. Next video. Bye-bye.